Mental health expert Dr. Armando Gonzalez joining us now live. Dr. Armando, first, thank you so much for being with us and give us your take on this suspension. I think that athletes are under so much pressure and they're no different than, than we are. We're under so much pressure nowadays, especially when we go through something like grief. And I just feel so much for Shakari. I thought she handled it so well by taking responsibility, but also I thought it was another huge miss uh, by the Olympics here in having an opportunity to really show some compassion and get outside of the, rig the rigidity of the rules and maybe look a little closer into her specific situation. You know, Richardson isn't the only professional athlete who's publicly addressed mental health. Just a few months ago, Naomi Oshaka withdrew from the French Open to prioritize her mental health. Talk about how important it is to support these athletes who seem to have it all. You know, I think that's one of the things, as you said, they seem to have it all. And so, so often there's a lack of compassion that we have in general towards mental health, but even more so for professional athletes, they, they get compensated well for what they do. So people are often less likely to have compassion for when they're going through mental health struggles, but what COVID-19 and post COVID did for all of us as a country and nation is shown us that we're all really struggling with our mental health. There are systems in place that need to be changed. And this is yet another instance of where the rules, the regulations, the systems are being challenged to start supporting people, including professional athletes. And I think it's time for huge change and it starts with compassion. And finally, what tips can you give our viewers for anyone at home who may be wondering how to work to address their own mental health? We are all going through collective grief. Shakari was going through the loss of her mom. We are all going through collective grief post COVID, if you're feeling senses of depression, anxiousness, I need you to know that you're not alone and there is help out there. Strongly suggest Googling or going to psychology today, finding a therapist, someone to work with, someone to support you. Uh, working on your mental health is actually the cheat code to finding strength in all areas of life. And it's something that you're gonna see in this year really defines how we bring ourselves back together post COVID. Important information. Thank you so much for being with us tonight, Dr. Gonzalez. We appreciate your time.